right. We're trying this new place called Seoul Meat and Korean Barbecue. They're located at Kirkland. Oh, it's heavy. This store's heavy. This area looks really nice and it has this convention oven. Sorry, Santino, you're in the pit thing. But yeah. And it looks like a side, like all you can eat. 33 is not bad. So beef brisket, the spicy beef belly. Everything is all you can eat. They're going to give you three limit per order and then when they finish it and all the sides are... Only thing costs extra are the drinks. Awesome. Look at that. Thinly sliced pork belly, pork jowl. Isn't that like the bacon we got before? Yeah, the one in... Uh, Lakewood. Yep. Oh! So they you want to do pork jowl and then some beef brisket. Yeah, that's always quick, quick. And then you want you want to try the thin uh, thin slice or truffle pork belly. What's that thin slice? Uh, thin slice the way uh, bottom one. Uh, Your seafood too. Oh man. Let's try truffle. Truffle. Okay. Okay. And then all these sides, I might get the chopped chicken and corn cheese. Oh man. And then look at all those sides. He brought us the main top ones. Some radish, kimchi, some different sauces. I think that's wasabi powder in that one. Fact. A friend came one from South Korea. Every time you cook on your grill, make sure you wipe it down. Because it doesn't stick. Let's try this kimchi out. We gotta try this kimchi out. Just, just see. It's not overwhelming. It has a nice bite. And, uh, because you know, kimchi is fermented. I thought it would be like as strong, but it is, it's real good. One of the sides I really like is the corn cheese. He wasn't kidding. Ew, it's small. You can, sh you can treat this like a shot. Oh, then we got the steamed egg. They said it should be enough for two people. We're starting with a brisket, truffle, and then we chose that pork jowl, which is like bacon. If you never get to try it, try it, y'all. A little smaller servings, but I think that's the mindset. Yes. Maybe the quality is a little higher. Ooh. So they gave us a little butter to uh, eat that. I really like this cooking. It's supposed to steam and like push the air up in this pan, which is nice. I'll try something. It really depends on how cook, well cooked you want your meat. Like the beef, you don't have to cook it too far ahead. Just try the quality, y'all. No sauce or anything. Look at that. Look at that. Very nice. You can tell there's a different quality compared to like other ones. Very nice. Put just a little soybean paste on there. Nice. I'm beeping with another Filipino man. Like a little powder, I think. Like, is that wasabi? Oh, salt. Pretty good. The meat doesn't feel as frozen as like other barbecue places. It's really nice. about y'all the pork chow this tastes like bacon and I don't know how to really describe it never tried this before y'all try it steamed egg this is included with our all you need all right steamy goodness look at that thank you this is 
pretty much steamed egg a little runny. It's just how the bowl is shaped and then how they mix it in there. Very simple, y'all. I also have some drop tray, which is like sliced noodles, uh, glass noodles, with like veggies and stuff. Really good. Again, this is included. I like how the portions are small, and I rather them do it because then it actually is go. You can order more, or you can just like make sure you don't overeat and like save room for the food. Looks like the pork belly looks almost done. Look at that pork belly, pork job. Look at that. Be careful with the pork. Very nice. Oh, that's where that plate was. Let's go for it. Where do you get yours? Pork belly real good y'all. I mean pork chow y'all. Now we have the truffle pork, pork belly on the thing. Um, here's that uh, truffle pork belly. Cooks really quick. Mm -hmm. As my friend's using a scissor, I'm warm. Basic on this, so I'm gonna try this. Mm -hmm. Wow. Real good. Like it's the the truffle that it has on top, it just cuts really good and makes a nice crust, y'all. Very good. Thank you. It's really nice, guys. I also recommend not overloading on the rice. Actually, just eating. Very good. Some more rice? Uh, yeah, one more spice. Alright, they also get soft tofu soup, which is a mini too. Again, smaller bowl. Look at that. Very nice. Got the top chef steak right here. Ooh, look at that. It's so dripping juice, y'all. Wow. It has wagyu. Very nice. Then we now have the thin pork belly. And then we also got the gall wheat right here later. You guys, you order any more meat in the first half? We're gonna try to finish this first quick and see. Thank you. We'll try this pork belly. Oh, yeah. Did you get that little crust on there? Very good. It's very nice, actually. This or this now? Huh? Or barely or the down. Alright, and then we got the cow beef. Look at that. Very nicely crusted and all. Try it. Real good crust. A little tangy. Um, whatever, like marinade put on there. They're real good. Got some of the spicy brisket, the beef belly, and some mussels. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's try it. Belly. Oh man. Good. 
not beefy, it's very light, not heavy at all, man. Very good. Look at that, y'all. They're slicing their own meat. Unlike, which I feel they just do, like, buy the pounds is like, frozen and everything. That's impressive. Pretty much good. You don't have to go through. It's bubbling already, so I'm not gonna leave it too long. And this way, garlic. Let's try it. Got a little of the juice running. It's like that garlic cheese sauce or something along the line. You can taste it. Big. Some of the uh, juices have been released from the muscle. Garlic butter a little strong. Real nice. All right, just wanted to finish off. That Korean barbecue was great. So their 12 to 3 is pretty much that, what, is their $33 price. Anything dinner time, they're adding two meats and I think they're higher quality and the price bumps up to 45, which makes sense. I think the two beasts they choose are like a rare, like a more expensive cut of meat. People, they were cutting the meat literally there. It's not frozen where I feel like some Korean barbecue places are like that and shipped to them. This place was cutting the meat, almost maybe fresh, I feel like. But place was good. The sides were great and it was all you can eat. That egg, that soup, all worth it. It's called Soul Meat Company. It's located in Kirkland, Washington. If you haven't been, definitely go. I think lunch menu is good. Maybe I'll do dinner time one time, but I'm good with what I tried. Just a wide selection of different meats, like with the pork belly, the way spicy, thin cut, truffle, and then the, the different meat and pork chow. And then you had the different brisket, that beef belly, beef brisket. You all have to try it. Definitely worth it. As always, take care and God bless. Go Thor Prince! Let's go!